Hey guys, what's going on? It's Steve here from Third Coast Custom Helmets. Just wanted to do a quick video for you guys about a new product um, that we haven't received in yet, uh, but we will start getting in. Um, but before I do that, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so y'all don't miss out on any of the posts that we do in the near future. Um, so yeah, let's just get right into it. As you guys can see here, we have a speed. This is a brand new speed. I just took the tags off of it last night. So what we're gonna do with it is actually, we're gonna change the color of this speed right now. Um, we're actually gonna chrome this speed. Obviously, I'm not at this shop, y'all can tell. I'm at my dining room table doing this to show you guys. Um, the face mask has been removed in an effort to save a little bit of time. So what we're gonna go over today is this. I don't know if you guys saw the story that I posted. A cover. This is how we're gonna change the color of the speed. This is a chrome cover, as you can see. This is crazy. I've never seen anything like this in my life. As you guys know, if you're familiar with chrome, we do a lot of chrome for a lot of the teams around here locally and some out of state. Uh, chrome, traditionally, y'all know when this happens, actually this should never happen with chrome because if it does, it spiders, it cracks, and it just goes to crap. But I am literally turning this chrome cover into a chrome football. Actually, it's more like a chrome gas tank. But as you can see, there's no, I'm balling this thing up. I mean, this is, look at this thing. It's like a slinky, man. This is nuts. Look at this. Look how flexible this thing is. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna change this. Oh, and as you can tell, this, this is an extra large cover for an extra large speed. When you order these, you have to order by the size. These aren't generic covers. They're made specifically for the helmet. So if it's an extra large, like this one, you would order extra large. If it's a large, if it's a small, whatever, they don't do 2XL. Um, they don't do Zenith until next year. They do the F7s, the, the Vengeance, so all the Shuts, they're not, not the older ones, all the Rydells, except for the Axiom, but I'm sure that's coming down the line, the Speed Flex, the, the, the Speed slash Victor, all those are covered, you're good. So what we're gonna do is, we're actually going to cover this up, see how long this takes. Um, it shouldn't take very long. Oh, I gotta pop the bumper down. Just put it down like that. As you can tell also, all the guts are still inside this helmet. Every pad is still inside. I haven't removed anything from this helmet. Just took the face mask off. Um, that's all you need to do according to the manufacturer. So let's see how long this takes. Um, I've never done this before. So uh, they said it doesn't take very long. Maybe about four minutes or so if you don't know what you're doing. So let's get to it um, and let's see. Oh, and before you forget, in case there's any pulling or anything, uh, I just want to let you guys know ahead of time, I am dealing with a little bit of uh, tennis elbow in both arms, so I can't really grip as strong as I need to or pull as much as I need to, if that is the case. So, other than that, let's see how long this takes. Um, so, my clock says 6, 6, 11. It's 6, 11, so here we go. Just put it over the top like this. Match it up. Let's push it down. Wow. And it just slides in the back here, the back of the bumper. I'm gonna scoot back here so I can put this thing on my lap so I can get some more force on it. Oh, didn't line it up correctly. 